let's talk about the pros, cons, and applications of these batteries. Uh, with these batteries, uh, people do sometimes confuse them with a lithium ion battery. So this would be a 12 volt, 100 amp hour lithium ion battery here. This one just doesn't have the casing around it. Um, this is a lithium titanate battery, which is a little bit larger. Uh, but um, unlike a lithium ion battery, these do not need a battery management system in order to balance the cells. They're self-balancing as are other lead acid uh, battery type chemistries. They weigh about 85% of what a typical lead acid battery would be for the same capacity versus a, a lithium ion battery, which generally is about um, one third the weight of a lead acid battery. So for if you do have weight concerns, if it's a portable use, lithium ion might be better. But if you're using it in winter time, you can't charge lithium ion batteries below zero degrees Celsius. Otherwise, you can permanently damage the batteries. With a silicon dioxide battery, you can recharge it and discharge it at minus 40 without any damage to the battery. So there are some pros and cons there. For remote locations where you might have uh, security, uh, monitoring, um, trail cameras, things like that, these batteries work in all environments and uh, temperatures. So they do have the versatility where a lithium ion battery um, might not last in winter time without uh, permanent damage. So with these, uh, we do recommend them for a variety of uses. And if you'd like any other information, please go to our website at www.azimuthsolar.com or you can contact us directly. Thank you.